I host a venue down in Philly at Drexel every Thursday night. Uh, we're pretty, I've got flyers and stuff, so that's my plug. If you want to fly a holler at me, I've got like a bunch of them. So I need to actually get them out of the way in my bag down and start to affect my posture. So help me out there. You know, just, just my, my chiropractic bill is a little high. Um, but I also like to devote my time to various charitable causes. Um, fuck the environment. Uh, club the seals. Kill the whales. And, <laughs> and this is actually my current, this, this, is, this poem is about my current favorite pet cause, and I hope y'all flow with me. The poem is entitled Double in Time, and people need to say I'm going to hell for it, or I'm going to heaven. But I think since I'm a poet, I'm going to end up in purgatory anyway, so fuck it. Uh, but yeah, so this is my pet cause. Fuck the handicap. The mobility challenge of the physically disabled, gimp, crippled, or handicapable, whichever term is appropriately labeled, fuck them. Fuck them all. Except the kids. <laughs> Unless they're charming. Oh. <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't start squirming to get squeamish. Let me ask you this. Cruelty or kindness when I say fuck the handicap. Since our society has been bleached blind by those media cats, fuck the handicapped. Who knows how long it's been since that ass has been tapped. <laughs> <laughs> Don't gasp and wheeze and disgust. Believe in me and trust that just as everyone needs love, everybody needs lust. As I stand here looking coquettish, feeling it's only beyond fetish, I just don't understand the need for mass debate when people who need knowledge are left to masturbate. Why discriminate when I think that we as a whole are more than a little kinky, at least according to Kinsey. Rational of inhibitions more than flimsy when every person is caressable. Reason enough my boudoir is wheelchair accessible. <laughs> Fuck the handicapped with all the best parking <laughs> everywhere in town. What a perfect place to get freaky. Go to town. Shit, go downtown. Whatever fits your flow. Get some booty, touch a show, and you won't get towed. <laughs> Fuck the handicapped. <laughs> Collectively, we make it a habit to marginalize anything or anyone not pleasing to our eyes when it only takes a shitty magic trick to see that our eyes lie. Unable to realize that perception is fact filtered by our minds. Why else is it understood that love is blind? Right. And, since I don't want to come off as biased or righteous, while we're at it, fuck the silence. <laughs> Don't be nervous if you find yourself smitten, craving visually impaired encounters forbidden. No need to be self-conscious to how your birthday suit's fitting. Just give your non-sided sex kitten a pair of warm woolen mittens. Found a fuck so well, you'll make mute people sing. <laughs> These are a few of my favorite things. <laughs> or 
are deformities, only differences, which isn't bad as a matter of fact. So I repeat myself for anyone whose memory may have lapsed, say it loud and mean it. Fuck the hand. <laughs>